Hey you folks, Quilly Teen here and welcome to another episode of a Let's Play Two Point Hospital! And we've got the ability to go over to Mighton University over here. We've also unlocked Tumble here, but yeah, I was gonna say, the demo only has the first four levels, and the demo is what I am playing over here, but in theory you'd be unlocking a lot more territory at this point in the campaign. We haven't even scratched all the possible maps. Looks like these career goals that we've achieved, we can go and collect our rewards over here, some more uh, Kaidosh over here, so that we can unlock some more buildings earn some money, hire more people, earn a thousand. So we've got that. Well, that's 500. We're going to get our arcade machine. Oh, and then there's the next level. So now it's earned 5,000. Ah, upgrade five machine. That has been collected over there. Wonderful. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and hop in to Mighton University, which I believe will teach us finally about research. Super excited to learn this. I don't know if this is the last major, major learning point of, re of the game like this quasi-tutorial that is the demo. Home to some of the brightest minds, Two Point County. It may be chilly, but it's also the perfect place for us to start developing some new technology. Might and University, research, and something. It went away too fast. The Chancellor of Might and University has been impressed by our progress, and we've been invited to establish Might and University Research and Teaching Hospital. This is a great opportunity for us. With access to some of the brightest minds in the county, we can set up a research department and develop some new tech. Firstly, though, we'll need a research license. The ministry will not grant us one if we can, will grant us one if we can demonstrate our technical prowess by establishing a hospital with some upgraded machinery. So we just have to upgrade one machine. Oh, this is a nice layout. Oh, very pretty. I mean, a little less organic than some of the others. This part of the county is quite cold. We'll need to put down some radiators to keep people warm. So noted. Now, do we have access? to a reception room, and we do. So that's new. Cancel this. How do I want to lay things out over here? What I'm going to do is I'm going to leave, tell you what, a Kugap wide hallway over here. Place hatch. Oh, it's desk. Oh, how cool is this? Okay, so now we can we can take in people more than one person at a time. Let's put a hatch at the back. No. Oh, maybe I can only have one. A couple plants in here and a radiator in the middle. Oh, that's so cute! Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna try to get the prestige up quite high. Let's see if we can get to level three. There you go, level three. And we'll put you in there for good measure. Uh, yes. Oh, the thing I put in the corner wasn't valid. Okay, so we can do this. We need to hire a single, at least a single assistant to get started. Uh, let's get Barrel Radish over here, higher skill. There, done. Okay, rooms. Let's get over here a GP's office. No money, no treatment. Let's say no money, no treatment. I guess we're in America. <laughs> and a radiator in here as well. Let's we'll see if we can get the prestige a little higher. Um, here, we'll put up a poster. No, a poster, I said. Hooray! Temperature. Some parts of the county are quite cold or too hot. We'll need to ensure people... To keep people comfortably... To keep people comfortable by ensuring they're warm enough, but also not too warm. If people are too cold or too hot, they may become unhappy and may eventually leave. In cold locations, place radiators around the hospital. In hot locations, the air condition. Use the temperature visualization mode to identify cold and hot areas of the hospital. So... Okay, this looks like it's cold because it's blue. All right, that sounds fine. Um, yeah, that's fine. Close this. We'll hire a doctor. Ooh, none of these have any skills. Now I know different areas will have different sort of skill balances and things like that. What I want to do next to this, so we're gonna have the GP next to it. I want to have a general di diagnosis, and then uh, you know we can pretty this up a little bit too. Maybe we'll get a radiator in here too. 
There we go. Level two. And then next to that, I'm going to have another diagnostic room of some kind. For example, cardiology. And you know, we'll keep the cardiology room nice and cool. We should put the clown posters behind people so they can run away. Uh, this... no. This machine here can be upgraded. Although we don't have a janitor with the skill, so it's not going to let us queue it up. No, we don't actually... we're going to have to train more of our staff up there. Let's get you, and actually, I'm going to hire a second janitor right away. And a couple of nurses. Barbara Latrine. Sure. And get you going on. Then, let's see. Oh, you're cold over here. I see the temperature zone. And this this room is actually super cold. Okay. Let's keep it going. Rotate, rotate. Bench, bench. And a bench in the corner. Snack machine. Drinks machine. Leaflet stand here. And there. Okay. I'm gonna get a ward going on, and again, I like it fairly large. My goal is to make, basically just have one ward. I wonder if six was enough for the beds to fit the way I like. I don't know, I'll go ahead and do this. Hopefully that can all fit. Okay, that's all right. Attention. Hmm. Has anyone seen my pen? <laughs> uh, all right. So seven length is actually fairly space efficient. If we did eight, we might be able to fit one more bed in there. So that's something to consider going forward. Build a couple more benches. Although I don't think there's much of a queue to go into the ward. And then I'm going to build the pharmacy right next to it. Three by three. Boom. Boom. Excellent. Oh, this probably needs to be warmed up. There you go. Queue up a couple of upgrades here. Although, I don't think we have a mechanics janitor, do we? Radiator. And a radiator in the ward as well. I suppose we could use them on the other side here, too. Okay. Oh, no, it looks like we are doing some repairs. Oh, right, the star rating. That's the repair thing. That's right. Or the upgrade thing. Unable to get where they want. Where are you trying to get? I think they resolve it right away because the warning goes away immediately. I've got to assume it's some sort of pathfinding thing. Like, someone's in the way, rather, is what I mean to say. Alright, so we need to upgrade a machine to get to the next thing, which we're working on. And we'll probably want to be ready for some upgrades, too. Sorry if I'm getting people dizzy with all my spinning. <laughs> and... Actually, cancel. Cancel. I do want to leave a little extra room for people to walk there. And actually, there's two 3x3 three three areas over there, so that'll work out fairly well space-wise. I'll put in the heaters afterwards. So you, we're going to do another general diagnosis room over here. Excellent. Has seen oh, no, there's not enough room. Oh, poop. Maybe I should move this all over. Let's move you. Edit. Drop you down over here. This is very handy, by the way. I love that this is a thing. Move you over here. Excellent. We can upgrade our heart racer to more, more effective. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's go ahead and queue that up, too. And I think what I'm going to do is build a tiny little training room over here. Like that, get you up front, and desk, desk. Required in so we can have room enough for five people in here. Even though we may not use it all the time, but it's nice to have options. There we go. 
those room cozy, toasty and warm. And we could get a second person ready to do upgrades. A lot of people could learn diagnostics, actually. We'll bring in Dr. Gregory Mouse. And we're gonna train all these people. We'll probably have to hire more. Misery Guts! But yeah, almost certainly we will need to then hire more people as a response to that. Yeah, general diagnosis needs a nurse. <gasps> research license! Great news! The two-point health ministry has granted us a research license to allow any of our hospitals to research new machines, upgrades, and more. To kick off a research project, we need a research room and a doctor with a research qualification. Diagnosis and treatment patient can also contribute to research progress. Harvesting ghosts can be very enlightening. Mm-hmm. Let's get a bookshelf for entertainment over here. Snack machine drinks machine, bench, bench, bench. Okay. And yes, we will hire um, another nurse, because we actually have some need. And uh, we don't have a doctor with the researching skill right now. Hangry. Minus 10% happiness all the time. Motivated, short-tempered, that's going to be okay. We want to get a second assistant? I don't know. We are waiting on another doctor over here, but mm, we need quite a few things. Sure. Hire. And hire. I don't know. This might impact our, our funds too much. Got a few staff of, of training slots. Well, we're working on some training for some people. It's going to be okay. And yeah, we, we'll leave that empty if we need to. Oh, we don't have a bathroom. Silly me. Let's build a toilet. Boom, boom, boom. Then we'll get a hand dryer. Sink. I like this layout. Can we fit a radiator in here without blocking things? That looks like it'll work. Oh, or not. Oh, what became invalid? The dryer. Hmm. Well, at least they can wash their hands. What would you like? Staff challenge, get a level four room. We should be able to get that at some point. We'll probably need to expand for it. What level is this ward? Level two. I mean, we might just build like the giant staff room. I'm not sure. Wow, we really do need a lot more nurses, huh? Upgrade our easy scan over here. Sure, we'll do that. Train a doctor in research. Complete chromotherapy. Cure a patient in chromotherapy. No assistant available. I guess we'll go and hire a second one. There we go. Some customer service or something. It's going to be fine. They're just on break. We don't have a break room yet. Okay, tell you what. I'll build the giant break room. Because that does seem to be something that people want a lot. Sofa. Sofa. Just tons of seating. We're at level three already. Dartboard. Drinks machine. Snacks machine. Many plants. Line these up on the grill, grid, like that. Staff's getting tired. I'm working on it. Nurse to general diagnosis. I'm gonna get a heater here and here because this seems like a pretty big room. We're nearly there. We'll just put up some random posters. There, you can pin the tail in the clown. Level four room, done and done. And it's pretty swell. I like it. Now I also want to unlock the, the arcade. Sweet Suspender News Agent. Arcade Machine. Bam! Sega! By the way, this game is published by Sega. Done and done. 
Can we see what the game is? <gasps> it's Sonic the Hedgehog! Hey! Oh man, someone's playing it right away. Well, I don't blame them. Night Fever Emergency. An outbreak of night fever after the closure of the county's oldest discotheque led to fury, mass hysteria, and dancing. There's a group that need a treatment. We'll be rewarded if we cure this. Okay, I wonder if you need a shrink's office. Uh, you need staff training, and we got the ch staff challenge done. Okay, we'll work on the training room as quickly as we can. Night fever patients are arriving. Uh, I'm going to assume we're going to want to open this. Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Welcome back to your favorite radio station. There's research, we don't have enough money for that. Set up a psychiatry office, because it's not very expensive to, to build. To Here, we'll go four by four. To bring some small of sophistication to your drab little In lives. here. Should any of you have any requests for popular tunes, as I believe people like to call them, do not hesitate to repress that impulse. I have no intention of playing any of that drivel. Let's get this to a level 4 room. A little heater. And some clown. And plants. Should organize them better, but there's okay. There's our prestige four, which is what I'm aiming for here. Get you there. Get you there. There you go. You can feel like you're entering a little forest as you come in here. How lovely. Okay, so we need a we need a shrink. Do we have a doctor who can do it? Not at this time. I'm gonna hire something. Uh, we may need another quick training room. I think that's probably the case. Can I copy an existing room? That'd be very handy. I don't think that's the case. Alright, that's okay. We'll build another little training room. Right over here. Uh, that door might not be positioned quite right, but... Take, uh, cancel, grab the door, move it here, trainee desk, force plenty, done. Staff training required, yeah, uh, that's a nurse, Who, is any one of these a doctor, junior doctor? I want you to study psychiatry, Dr. Herman Freud, and we'll go ahead and get lots of people training in psychiatry over here, so we've got some extra pool people. Do we need a loan? Maybe. Lazy bones disease! Lack of calcium! Oh yeah, the ward! They'll be fed nurse and- er, nurse. They'll be fed nurse, yeah. They'll be fed milk and cookie by a nurse. Need more cash to come in. I may have overspent. Oh, look at this queue! It's terrible! I feel though, these guys are gonna start leaving. So even though spending might be a little dangerous, I'm gonna go ahead and get some seating for them. And maybe we can make some money off them with a snacks machine and a drinks machine. I don't know if we make money off of this or it's basically just an expense to keep people happy. Whatever. Expensive or not, I want the arcade machine. Okay. I try to train some shrinks. Yeah, still no one available. And none of the- we, there's not a lot of skills available here. That is- this is a hard location because we don't have the skills right away. We have to train people up manually. Whew. Now, we can take out a loan if we need to. I think we're gonna be okay. I don't think we're gonna run out of money, but it's certainly slowing some things down. Oh, you guys are complaining about the cold. Yeah, that's kind of legit. That room's warm. This one is not. I'll just put a radiator, sort of. There. Is that garbage? It is. We'll probably. Oh, there's no bin over here, but I am gonna get another um, janitor. Yeah, look at the garbage from the snacks. Figured a bin, sort of in the middle of the hall, maybe over here actually. Can I put one in the corner? No, it's gonna block the door, huh?
At least this one's somewhere within range. Okay. Let's go to fast forward. Staff promotion. Yes, please. Oh, you can be trained. Staff training required. I don't think we have a ghost capture, and we're going to want that. Peter Geist. Unaffordable. Ooh, never mind. Huh. So, we'd have to train... We could train them in something where there's already someone that's got the skill. Like mechanics over here to save money. Be anything suspicious? Please investigate further. Holistics is apparently going to open another right. of its That's gonna get cleaned. Oh these cues! Well we don't have we don't have people, we don't have enough people kicking around here. Um do we hire another doctor? I mean I guess so. Dang. We don't have that many doctors in training. Well, no, we do have a few getting their psychiatry stuff. I guess that's what's going on there. Visitor from Holistics. Rival executive and CEO of Holistics, Augustus Lavender, is coming to the hospital soon. Say what you like about the guy, he does smell good. He's pretty harmless, we should keep an eye on him in case he becomes a nuisance. Impress the VIP with a nice hospital. Yeah, well, we'll see what we can do. Come on! Shrink it up! So, if we look at the money, and the overview... There's diagnosis... I think we just make money by curing people, not by giving them the snacks. Long queue warnings, three rooms, long queues, people about to rage quit. <laughs> people waiting for a new room. Are there people waiting for a new room? Really? Oh! Deluxe clinic! Did I tell him? I think I told him to wait. Um, oh, we don't have enough money to build it. But we'll get money if we treat people. Yeah, our money is going down pretty fast. Sadly, we didn't cure enough the patient group. Damn it! We didn't have shrinks. They came too soon. All right. Loans. 5% interest. Okay, we're going to take out a loan so that we can build a deluxe um, clinic so that we can cure people faster. I should have probably put the door somewhere else here, but... Boom. We can get maybe a little bench in that back corner. And they might be cold in there, but the people aren't going to spend a lot of time in it. So I might not bother adding anything in there. People are running around a lot in a panic. Eight people are still waiting here, although... No, I mean, the night fever. I guess we failed the quest, but they're still here. I know. We've almost got a doctor, though. Really? It's gonna happen soon. We're having lots of shrinks. I may have overdone it on the, the shrink training, but I think we'll probably end up with a second one later on, and it is nice with the overlap. Are you are you really dancing on things? Oh, you're a teacher. We now bring you this segment, Sir Nigel Reviews. Yeah, taking advantage of those traits would be nice. I don't know if the hype will hire have those traits, it would be handy if they did. And what a delight for the experience. Staff promotion, sure. The Promote three staff. Oh, I should have accepted that first, because we would have gotten credit towards it. Still, there's going to be more promotions soon. Apparently, we're slowly auto-researching. I guess every time we diagnose and things like that. $10,000 for completion of some training. Hey! Promote. There we go. So people are coming in here, and they, they, people seem to finish it in a slightly randomized order. It's probably based on when they entered the room, I just realized. Because they don't all enter the room at the same time. You're done. Promote. Yes, train now. Student nurse. I think... Increase injection skill 20%. There. I'm going to get more diagnostic stuff going on. I'll train with you. 
you already have this. What happens if we queue someone up? Like, you literally already have that class. Or do you, oh no, it's partial. Well, no, you've, you've got it, but you are learning it? That's very confusing. Estimated time. So the more people are training simultaneously, it does take longer, but you get the advantage of training simultaneously. All right, we'll leave it there. Looks like we do have some things that need some janitors. Increase skill. Oh, we've got someone with ghost busting. Although I guess we already trained that up, but still, we're gonna get that going down there. You're training up. There'll be more promotions coming soon. You can't train. The other room is busy right now. Oh, look at those ghosts. So, we need to train a doctor in research, which we will do as soon as we get a chance, and I guess I'll build the research room. You need to be 4x3. Well, look at that. That's 4x3 right there. Okay, research pod. I don't know how people get in and out of here. And then researcher's desk, so presumably you can have multiple researchers at the same time. I'll stop there. Things are being upgraded, that's nice, that was very expensive. Start a research project, either click on the research pod or drop a researcher into the room. In the research screen, you can select a project from the available project list. Once project is started, you'll need a doctor with a research qualification to carry out the work that will contribute research to the project over time based on the research skill. Research is shared across the whole organization as are the discoveries we make. You can start a project in one hospital, continue work in another. So, chromotherapy. Designs a machine to cure gray anatomy. Ah ha ha! Uh, start project. So there's a slight fee, and we do need a researcher ready to go for that. Okay. We'll work on it soon. We have a critical shortage of nurses. Our reporter on the field, Sally Fig Blanket, has just returned with her camera crew from another field trip. As to what she was reporting on, I cannot say. Nobody tells me anything. I think that, I mean, there's clearly some in training. But still, we're going to want to keep training people all the time. So an over cat uh, overload on people is good. Man, things are messy. I think we had a lot of upgrades queued up, and our janitors keep being busy with that. I guess we'll get one extra janitor. And it seems worthwhile to keep hiring the, the most skilled people. So I'm going to want to trade two people in research if possible, I think. Yeah, see, these are all... No, that's training, but... That's an upgrade being done. Free training slots? I know! I don't think I'm going to run more than two training rooms. Otherwise, we're just paying for a lot of people who aren't doing anything other than training. Money's definitely going up, though. We could probably pay off the loan. Well, I'll keep it for now. 5% interest rate isn't too bad. Ooh, people are being delivered by ambulance? You're currently too cold. Yeah, these toilets need some work. Like, come on, janitors, get in here. Are they really just that busy? Now, what don't we have? We built the deluxe clinic. We don't have the clown clinic. Has to be four by four. Cardiology, we have a little running thing. I built the pans. Uh, no, I don't think I did. Boom. And these are probably in need of some heaters as well. You've got that. You don't. I guess, you know what? I'll heat it after all. I want to heat some of these little sub hallways and areas too. Unable to get where he wants. Well, I don't know where he wants to go. New illness! Oh, Mockstar! Hey! Believe themselves to be one of the greatest rock stars the world has ever seen, but are sadly Gaga. The puns! <gasps> Year end reward, er, uh, awards. We'll take a look. Still tons of repairs waiting to be done. 
Man, this training nearly eats people for a long time. Show me! Open all. Yeah, we just got Rising Star again. One day, we'll get more. Maybe I should build smaller training rooms. Wow, we need... Where's our janitors? They can't possibly all be in training. The new number one album from We've got five Odyssey. janitors. Featuring the hit singles. We have as many janitors as doctors. You're over here. And fish I guess I can probably grab you. Here, come here. Well, that's all I can an upgrader deluxer. I think we can, uh, can't upgrade that. I guess we will, though again, that'll just use up a janitor for a while, but... Done, done, done. Now, is it here that we're training them? That's diagnostics. Mechanics learned. Okay. Student doctor, you are going to train in research by Dr. Imogen, Imogen Crank. And actually, I'm going to do both of these as well. Everyone's going to go and learn research. We're going to have three. We've got two stations. We'll have three of them. Promote, promote. Staff challenge completed because we promoted lots of people. Wonderful. All right, you're here cleaning. Look at the janitor stuff takes a long time. Hospital is a mess. The other CEO won't be that impressed. You are incredibly unhappy. Low hygiene. Desperate for the toilets. Wants training. Well, I mean, like... Just go, man. Take a break. The toilet's over here. Toilets actually... Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, look at you. You're all gray. You have gray anatomy. I guess the tr toilets are being used pretty heavily here. How much does it cost to upgrade? To purchase this? Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'll build another toilets over here. I'm gonna go larger. Just be easier to fit everything in here. Hand dryer. Sink. Radiator. Bin over there. And a pretty plant. Almost, but not quite leveled up. One more plant. There we go. Yay! Okay. CEO is leaving. We'll see what he thought about everything. Now, we do should have another shrink. I realize that some of them are in here. But I think we do have a spare. I thought we trained three people in psychiatry. Let's see. Staff. Filter to doctors. Yeah, you're working in a GP's office. I need to pick you up and drop you in there. I'm just going to turn off your GP's office. You can potentially do other things, but... And I guess we'll hire another doctor. Although, again, no skilled doctors available here at all. Man, we're going to do a lot of training. Hearing more patients visiting the hospital would improve our hospital reputation. Wow, our reputation's super bad! Maybe that's why we're getting so, uh, so few qualified doctors. Dang! Alright, let's speed things up. Career goal. Hooray! We've watered a hundred plants. We've got a lot of K currency, and we've got more waiting for us as well. But we're in debt, yeah. Huge debt. I'm not going to take out another loan right now. At least we're starting to cure some more people now that we've got the shrink. Uh, if we take a look at illnesses, so misery guts gets cured in a pharmacy, and it's such a low percentage chance. I wonder why. Now we do have a pharmacy, right? Yeah, right over here. If ever you have found yourself at a loss as to the correct usage of the English language, all right. Publicity update: you impressed. He was impressed. Good. 
Uh, we'll get you to wait. We're working on it. Sure, we'll promote you. Freudian lips was discovered. Oh, sure. Train now. Student nurse, maybe we'll just do the one. More diagnostics, perhaps. And we'll get one of the... To save money, we'll get one of the other nurses to teach it. Yeah, see, I don't understand. You already have the skill. Maybe it's a bug. Train there. So, we have research started now. There we go. Done. Train doctor in it. We've got to complete the research project. And then cure a patient who's got it. We don't have a shrink available right now. And you're still training those. Okay. Yeah, you'll be fine soon. Let's promote you. As soon as all this is done, we'll have our shrinks back and an extra researcher as well, so we can keep working on this. I'm complaining over here. We spent a lot of money upgrading or unlocking this, and we're not making huge use of it right now, but we will. That's probably where we're going to put the uh, chromotherapy clinic. Yay! Completed some training. So every time we complete some training, we get some money. So I think that might be how they're balancing this mission is giving us uh, the training money, but we don't have competent doctors. Staff challenge, generate 500 research points. All right, well, we'll try our best. I'm leaving this research room empty right now until someone mentions that they really want research or uh, uh, training, just because we're trying to not spend as much and we want to have more doctors active. Yeah, we're going to try not to take out a loan. You want some fun? There's an arcade machine right there. Go on in. Get yourself diagnosed, buddy. Freudian lips. Oh, you're probably being um, actually treated right now. 72% chance. Our skill's pretty low. We might want to get some, like, level 2 psychiatrists going on at some point. Patients are reminded not to believe in ghosts. They can literally see ghosts running around in here. All right, money continues to go up. Uh, we're gonna get you to wait. We're almost there. Ooh, we want a pay raise. Staff raises nation, 90 days to improve things. Student doctors, oh, because we've been training people. Yes, we wanna go to staff and here and satisfy pay raise requests. Absolutely, we're gonna need to do that. We've got a lot of patients are hitting low health, but there's some people like here getting treatment right away, gave up waiting on chromotherapy and stormed out. I'm sorry, we're working on it. So he needs his happiness to get up to 20% or he'll storm out, but his happiness is increasing because we're actually paying him properly. There we go. Hooray. Let's decide to stay after all. Good. Oh my god, these cues. Okay. I have only one word to say to you today. Trousers. People. Trust. Trousers. We need more G uh, GP's offices. How did we not learn that lesson at the last hospital? Here, we're gonna set you up sideways. Like that. That's gonna be fine. Lock you down. Rooms. GP office. Like that. Door. Boom. Boom. Done. And yeah, we do need more doctors. Nurses required over here. Two nurses are needed. Ooh, ooh. Do I keep hiring? Oh, looks like it filled itself up. That's going to be okay. Unable to get where you want. And you guys are cold over here. Research project complete! Hooray! When a project's completed, researchers will look for work elsewhere unless we kick off another project. As we make new discoveries and travel to new parts of the county, our boffins will propose new areas of research. Keep your eyes peeled. Okay, we'll get another one soon, but first we need to make a new room for chromotherapy over here. It needs to be four by three. It's not really room for something else. Tell you what, I'll go ahead and make it just slightly longer. Okay, can't afford item. Cancel. 
Research complete. I will assign a new research project uh, for upgrades that might be worthwhile. Re training research. Investigate new research methods to help us train even better researchers. Oh, it unlocks research four. No, we'll research more more rooms right now. Okay, you gave us some money. We got a staff promotion. 21 grand, okay. We do have enough right now. Boom. 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 We'll make the room better later. Then we can start training people, or treating people. So we'll RG give them back their RGB is what we're gonna do. You guys are all cold. Look at all the great people. Done. Done. Probably set up some chairs or benches over here. Can more than one person sit in a bench? Or should we be using chairs instead? Drinks and snack machine. Lots of great people. More promotions. Yeah, okay, two people can use it. Good. Toilets seeing fairly heavy use still. Lots of waiting in queue. But we still have the sub-diagnostic rooms, which is okay. Curing more patients would be good. <gasps> Potty mouth! When the patient opens their mouth, terrible things happen. Caused by drinking water from a toilet sink. Or a toilet. Ew! What is wrong with these people? Don't do that. Oh, more deaths. So you need research doctors, but yeah. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to try uh, Diagnostics 2 training with Dr. House. One, two. Three people. Oop, or not, because we can't afford it right now. Two people. Just infection discovered. We have the declownifier room already, and we never used it. So it'll actually be nice to have now. So we could now, at this point, really specialize doctors for um, diagnostics. Actually, I guess we could specialize people in the GP room diagnostics and then force them to stay in there. Seems like a really good idea. We've completed research, we just need to cure someone with it. We've got this set up. It'll need a nurse, but no one's actually in queue for this right now. Let me put a little chair outside of this. Oh, I have no money. I'm in debt. But we're bouncing back, it's gonna be okay. We actually hit level 10. We just have so much staff. And we're just desperately waiting for diagnostics. Looks like we do get paid a lot with every level. Okay, you're going to Deluxe Clinic. That's good. Yeah, X-ray machines would be handy. You guys want some training. Okay. So you have no training right now. So general practice. There we go. We're going to give you that. Do this. And I'm gonna get, there we go, three student doctors with no step, anything right now. You're gonna be studying general practice and you'll be assigned to those GP rooms a little bit more directly. Although we might do a few more rounds of training with you first. And in the meantime, we're still short on doctors, but ooh, there's our expenses. We've got so much staff! So I think we're still waiting for someone else to be diagnosed with the Grey's Anatomy right now. Fatalities 1, Rage Quit 2. Desperate for toilet. They've been in the hospital almost a year. <laughs> I mean, the time flow is different here, but yeah. None of these toilets are in use. I think we're getting more deaths, but... I think we still get research points for vacuuming up um, ghosts, so, you know, it's not all bad. We'll be fine. We don't need a loan. You just encourage me to, to have to pay more interest. That's bad. Uh, 
Uh, we can't train you right now. What is this? Oh, that's the research. You would like some training. Yeah, we'll probably uh, send you to research too. Yay, more expenses. No one being diagnosed over here. A plus 81%. That was actually pretty good progress towards whatever it was. I mean, the diagnostics is definitely the bottleneck, not the curing. I mean, maybe I do have to take that alone so I can just hire a bunch more doctors. I mean, it feels like a training like this is important, but I'm worried about our staff challenge. Get staff morale to 80%. I suspect that will be quite hard to do. That's at 52%. No, I don't know. Alright, let's take out a loan. We're not going to go overboard on how much we take. Well, we still took a fair bit. Higher. Higher. Promote. That's why you need insurance like Swindles Insurance. Hire some more doctors. Okay. Because peace of mind is worth Staff a challenge. Generate some research points. Well, that is definitely going to happen. This is two point radio. This insane cue. Diagnostic. Only 5%. His happiness went up from being seen, but that's it. We might need some more fancy diagnostics rooms. Oh, there's not much of a cue there. Maybe, or a cue. There's literally zero Q over here, so maybe... I don't know. I wonder if the GPs send people to the others? Now, we may, part of the problem might just be that we've had a huge backlog created, but... I'm gonna go ahead and set up some more. People do, like, rebalance it, so... And hire more doctors! Done. Sure. Okay, we got more awards. Promotion, promotion. Oh, staff training. There we go. We will train you in research two. And we'll pay it that way. And maybe you can train more people afterwards. Okay. So the queues got spread out, so at least, you know, there's that. Just trying to scrooch it over as much as possible without being in front of the door. There we go. Some benches for people, anyway. Unable to get where they're going. Was it you? Are you Eugene Windfall? No. Juliet, pull over. So, I mean, we have some people who are great out here, but I don't think they've been diagnosed. Pause. Is it you? And you're too cold right now. Yeah, you haven't been diagnosed at all. Hmm. Yeah, these are guys are all really cold. There we go. Now that's less of a problem. Fifty-four percent progress over there. That's good. We still have some cash left over from a loan. Or not anymore. Our expenses are insane! How are we gonna do this? I may have just grown too quickly. But we have like a million patients in here. They're just not getting treated very quickly. Okay, you're taking a break. Uh huh. I like not pay rise them quite as much here. Oh, there we go. Staff training. We're going to keep going with general practice training. Use one of our doctors to do it. You already have it. Like, I don't... I don't understand. Why don't let me do that? Okay, we're going to go crazy with this. I realize, again, it'll take these guys out of commission. But I think we've got to invest for the future. And investing for the future means having a lot of people trained in general diagnosis. 
More ghosts. More dead. Hey, we're making some money. Oh, we captured Trevor Volcano. Good. Morale's never gonna get there. We'll just cancel that quest. Because it's just gonna annoy me when it fails. I think we had a bunch more deaths in a row. These rooms over here are cold. People are complaining about it. So open your eyes and your ears and get ready to find out what's really going on. Oh man, do we want to watch the awards? Is that even a good idea? Musical instruments. Oh, this is gonna be so bad. Alright, we've won one of these Rising Star Awards. I wonder what, like, determines this. Busiest and handiest. Probably how many things they fix and upgrade. We want another Rising Star! Improve the most. And that's all we ever win. There's a queue outside of Psychiatry, really? We might want more, then. Oh, yeah, 11. It is actually getting pretty serious. Let's go build another Psychiatry office over here. Not Pharmacy. Because, yeah, the Psychiatry is really slow. It's used both for diagnosis and treatment. There you go. Level 2. Waited too long. They're here almost a year without treatment. New illness! Mucky feet! Feet so grubby that filth will never come out. Spreads germs like wildfire. Fire. Ooh, that's not good. And we're desperately lacking on doctors. And these rooms are frigid. I'll just put you here. There we go. And this room never got warmed up, but there. Train now. This is a nurse. We could just go for things like stamina or motivation, you know, just more speed for things. That's probably a good idea. You can train internally. And... There. A janitor, another nurse, and there's a researcher, doctor... I would like a doctor. Here, right over here. Done. So I sort of spread the skill along uh, through different disciplines. Uh, we, we're not lacking an assistant over here. We do have two. They're not both in training or something weird like that. They must just be on a break. Okay, there. Someone else came. There. Should be okay. And yeah, lacking doctors everywhere. We can upgrade our dehumifier. Money's going surprisingly up. It might be okay. Take a second to do more upgrades. Increase our success rate with training is probably a good thing. <gasps> I think, did you just get cured? You were a patient that was in there. Gray Anatomy. Chance of success was 58%. Treatment failed. Oh, no! I don't uh, suppose, no. We have to research the upgrade for that. I say one thing, and then another thing. And I say one thing, and then Uh, staff. There we go. Staff pay requests as training is developing. Staff challenge, promote three staff. That we should be able to do. Very unhappy. Bell nerd. I don't know if there's anything we can do to improve the colorizer. Man, we got some really upset people. Let's get another arcade machine. More arcade machines. More makes everything better. Staff, it will happen. Staff organization warning, bell nerd. We'll promote you. So, okay, let's pause a sec. Bell nerd. Is that you? You're on a break. <clears throat> Your happiness is very low. You do need a toilet. And you want training. Well, I will get you training. I would like to train you in general practice too. We'll hire someone to do that. 
and we'll go ahead and get even more people trained towards general practice. Because I do want that to improve a fair bit. Even though it means, again, our doctors are not going to be actually working right now, but it seems like it's probably an okay idea. Can't get somewhere. I think you're fine! No doctors researching? Oh, there they go. Reputation is still, like, nothing! The prices you charge, the publicity, people who come in. Speaking of prices, though. Price reputation. I mean, we could boost the prices, but that will just keep hurting our reputation some more. Oh, she decided to stay. Hooray! I think she's happy that she's getting training. Also, she might have gone to pee. She desperately needed that. I mean, you know, staff promotions, it does cost us more when they promote, but they do everything better, so it's better. There we go. Can we actually colorize someone? I want to see what this looks like, too. Do they just get spray painted? Oh, there we go. I think that's exactly what's going to happen. Okay, some red color. Oh, look at him! Oh, it's all the way around. So now he's all red. Oh, that's quite cool. Now we're going to inject some green in here. And we got money going on. We could repay the loans, especially the 10% one. There we go. 5% interest isn't so bad. We can probably make more money than 5% interest costs. Done! One star is completed! It bodes well that your organization has begun to dabble in research. Our initial notes suggested, wrongly it seems, that you weren't well suited to this particular task. Rest assured that whoever was responsible for such an off-the-mark remark... Off-the-mark remark, that's great. ...will be losing their job forthwith. Unless it was me, of course. Perish the thought. Continue with your studies for more rewards, or else go elsewhere and expand your organization. Unlock the Encyclo Enci Encyclopedia Booth Bitcase 1 and the Deluxe Olux 3. Oh, I didn't realize you keep upgrading those. That's very nice. 419 days. That is a pretty long wait, I will give you that. So this is the final map in the demo. Now, it doesn't mean we have to stop here. Can we do more training over here? Start training course, yeah. I would love... Research 2. Taught by this doctor. It's going to train this doctor. And that's it. There's another person kicking around, but... Well, unless we want to keep you as a psychiatrist, that's the thing. We sort of did a weird 50-50 mix here. Hmm. We don't have anyone with ward management. It seems like it would be a good idea here. You two nurses over here are going to learn ward management. And then we can keep training you up that tree. Staff challenge, promote three staff. And you want a promotion. Excellent. So we can expand that. Yeah, online challenges. That's so cool that's a thing too, right? Like, if you've done this before in these hospitals, and you've done the main campaign, it doesn't mean that you can't keep going. I love the fact that we're just basically PTSDing these clowns. Until they give up. Lose their humor. It is in fact nothing but Staff training required. We'll work on it very soon, I promise. Well, I guess oh, another dead body. At least. Another one bites dust. Zero percent cure rate for a potty mouth so far. One ineffective treatment and eight people have died from it. Needs pharmacy. It's starting to get a bad reputation. Yeah, you don't say. Now, we only have the one pharmacy. Where is it? It's over here. It doesn't have a queue, and we can't upgrade the drug mixer. What we could do is train a couple of nurses to be expert pharmacists. See, you got the diagnosis skill. Yeah, it looks like we could really go a long way towards optimizing some of these, some of these setups here. All right, we got training courses. We got the ward stuff, which is going to be nice. We got a couple of people for the ward training, and we can go assign them there. So, like our staff. Uh, job assignments for nurses. So we can say, don't work in the pharmacy because you're really good at diagnosis. Um, general, general diagnosis in specific. Now, this is any diagnosis and some more of these jobs have that. Don't do the clown clinic. Don't do the chromotherapy. Uh, don't do the ward because we're going to do ward training. Cardio, cardiology is a place where people will um, 
we'll go for a diagnosis, so that wouldn't be so bad. And yet, over here, we kind of want to go and do something like just work the wards. Like that and like that. Actually, we could almost turn it off for the others once the training is done. We'll see. Inflated ego! Dangerous buildup of narcissistic thoughts. If left untreated, parts of the ego begin to protrude from, near every, from every orifice, which is highly unpleasant for anyone nearby. Psychiatrists must carefully deflate the ego using a massive pin. Uh, YouTubers are especially likely to get this. It doesn't say that, but it should. Lack of doctorage. Money's coming in now, though. Very bored, desperate for the toilet. 571 days! <laughs> it's like the Canadian healthcare system. Um, we probably need more toilet. We've got one here, we got one here. There's not one here. If we did go and buy this room, and I mean, in a, we do have the money for it. We could buy here, buy, build some toilets here, so at least these people will go there. Maybe they don't go to the toilet in, in buildings they're not in. I don't know what the rules are for this. That could certainly be a thing. Cure 50 patients? Hey, we're working on it. We're trying to cure some patients. All right, we complete another training course. Injection room required for mood poisoning. Dangerous condition that causes the sufferer's health to deteriorate fast. Caused by paying too much attention to what other people think. Something, something, YouTubers are prevalent to this. Uh, get the patient to wait. Hang on a second. Can I build that now? Okay, let's buy this. No. I can't build it now. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten him to wait. Well, keep working on that. Oh, extra staff. Oh. There we go. So we can we can have up to two extra staff in here. So the primary doctor works here, and then there's assistants. I see now. Okay. I'm starting to understand. Let's build that bathroom. I went to toilet, toilet, toilets. Parfait recently. It was Let's go four by four by again. An experimental and one, two, three, four. At the tent wall. My Unix X toilets. Hand dryer. Sink. Bin. Radiator. Oops. And go. Promote you. Desperate for toilet. Killed someone. Wow! I didn't realize they get upset from killing someone. <laughs> it doesn't bother me at all, so I don't understand why it would be a problem for them. <laughs> oh, that's great. Maybe more of these little research rooms. I don't know. I'm worried that we're going to have too much of our staff simultaneously being researching. Or st learning is what I mean, not research rooms, rather than anything else. And that might be bad. Yeah, like, I want people to learn skills faster, but it would probably be a mistake. Getting more people with a training skill might be a good idea, but... Oh, another death. Health depleted. Our reputation is still nothing. <laughs> oh, well, we're gonna wrap this up here. We've gone for over an hour. Um, we will be doing some more of these in the future. I guess one of the questions is, am I going to continue on with the demo and try to hit three stars everywhere? I think I will. I think we will play the demo long enough to try to hit three stars everywhere. And then we'll have to wait until the full version comes out. Hopefully, hopefully I'll get a, a, an early copy of the full version as well. Although, we never know these things. This, oh, this room is cold, huh? I don't really think, no, it looks like I can do that. Hopefully it doesn't screw any pathfinding up for anyone. Uh, this bathroom looks like it's chilly. There we go. And some of the hallways as well, but I'm less concerned with that. Okay, I gotta wrap it up here. Thanks for watching, folks. I will see you guys 